for years I dined in hell. When I lived in Ojai, I'd make the 50 mile round trip to Arby's and Ventura, buy a bunch of regulars and then freeze them so I could write books and never have to worry about what to eat. I had fast food out the yin yang for more than a decade. When I started going out with Joanna, things changed slightly. I learned how to boil water and fix ramen noodles. When we got married, she started preparing all kinds of things. I have a hard time eating spinach, or I did then. Just the word would put me off. So Joanna started calling them gorilla greens because one day I said eating big green leaves in my salad, I didn't know what they were, made me feel like a gorilla. The things she made were so good, one day I told her as long as I don't know what's in it, I'll eat it. I try everything she puts in front of me now and love virtually all of it. She's a university professor and still finds time to make scrumptious things for us. The refrigerator can be practically empty and I'm like, let's order pizza and she says, no, I have an idea. And I'm bummed because my chance for pizza was shot down. The next thing I know, she puts this plate in front of me. Here's a picture of it. It's a couple of corn cakes filled with grilled corn, zucchini, onions, red pepper, and topped with this delicious queso fresco sauce. It was fantastic. I was glad I didn't get the pizza. Her cooking has been first rate for so many years that hearing the names of the stuff in it rarely puts me off. Now, here's a small sample of some of the stuff she's done. This is grilled asparagus with glazed carrots and roasted chicken. Here's some party spirals of cream cheese with red pepper jelly, gorilla greens, pimento, cheddar cheese, and she rolled them in either a sun-dried tomato tortilla or a green tortilla. I think it was made from Gorilla Greens. These are phyllo triangles filled with sautéed mushrooms, onions, sausage. Here's some grilled barbecued chicken and some chicken with soy sauce and brown sugar. This green bean salad. I don't like green beans, but the way she chopped them up small and puts toasted almonds in there, it's great. Perhaps the coolest thing we do now is once a week we take 45 minutes and sit down and make 14 salads together, enough for both of us for the week. I chop up a bunch of romaine lettuce, it stays fresher longer, and she chops up bell pepper and tomatoes, then we finish off the salads with white beans and grated cheese. Then each day for lunch, we dress a couple right before we eat them and never have to worry about what's for lunch. And these are only a few of the things she's made that I happen to take pictures of. Ask anyone who's ever been to one of our parties or over for dinner and see what they say about my wife's food. My point is this, I used to dine in hell. Now I dine in heaven with an angel.